To start out with, you will need four alligator clips, and they will cost less than $2. Next, you will need two sizes of dowels, a one-inch dowel and a half-inch dowel. They are three feet long. Next, you will need a set of screws, small enough so that you can attach the alligator clips to the dowels. Search until you find ones that are small enough to fit the alligator clip. When you get your supplies, also get the springs you'll use to turn around and create the tool. These springs are 9 and 30 seconds, and they work great for a half-inch dowel. There are two in the package. Use wire cutters and remove the loop off both sides of the spring. You need a cut of the one inch dowel at three and a half inches. Also, you'll need to drill a half inch hole in the bottom for an inch and a half in length. Cut angles on the top of the one inch dowel like this where the hole has been drilled. Clean up the uh, cut it, the drilled area by smoothing it down with a exacto knife or a pocket knife and sand it so it's nice and smooth. Cut the half inch dowel to three and a quarter inches in length. Also drill a hole in the top the size of the spring that you purchased and make the hole one half inch from the top of the dowel. Clean the uh, hole out like this so it's nice and clean. Also, uh, using a knife, taper the edges up from the hole to the top and also taper from the sides like this. Take two of your alligator clips and remove the screw from the bottom of them. And in this area here, you'll want to drill out the, the uh, a hole the uh, size of the screw that you're going to be using to install this on the tool. Test the teeth of your alligator clip by putting leader in it like this. Pull tight and make certain that the leader does not slide through. Make sure it's nice and solid like this. Uh, the teeth may not line up and so a lot of them will not be secure. So check your clip before you drill it and get ready to install it on your tool. Position the alligator clip at the very top of the dowel like this. And then drill a hole where the screw will be going into the dowel from the alligator clip. This will help the screw go in easier. Make the hole smaller than the screw you're going to use. Press the dowel in the half inch dowel into the one inch dowel and align the uh, uh, tapers on the end to be the same on both sides like this. Press the spring through the dowel and position it so there are about four rings uh, uh, protruding through on the, si the short side. You'll cut the other side with wire cutters so that there's four uh, loops there as well. When you do, cut the spring on the bottom so that the cut will not interfere with the leader when it's being loaded. Measure from the top of the spring down the dowel three and three quarters inches and then place a black mark there. Take a uh, brad and hammer it through the dowel so that it secures the half inch dowel inside it. The assembled tool will look like this when it's completed. The alligator clips go down the side like this and actually hold the line. I'll show you how to tie it in just a moment. Um, you'll notice that the alligator clips on top really don't line up exactly. That's perfectly fine as long as it can hold the line on either side. 
That's what we need.